Hello, this is Smita Kumar and you're watching MediCircle. Today on our AIDS awareness series, we have Dr. Malik Mufik with us. Dr. Malik is a sexologist, Ayurvedic physician, and he's currently practicing at Ayurveda Sanjeevani Herbal Clinic at New Delhi. For the past 19 years, he has worked as an Ayurveda physician. Hello and welcome to MediCircle AIDS awareness series, Dr. Malik. HIV के साथ रहने वाले लोगों की संख्या लगभग 24 लाख होने का अनुमान है। भारत के कुछ राज्य जैसे कि महाराष्ट्र, आंध्र प्रदेश और कर्नाटक में सबसे ज्यादा HIV पेशेंट्स पाए जाते हैं। भारत में हर साल HIV रोग से संक्रमित होने वाले लोगों की संख्या ANI रिपोर्ट के अनुसार लगभग 62.97 यानी 62.97% होने का अनुमान है। so, Doctor, I would like, like to ask you, what do you believe the difference between AIDS and HIV is? Yes, uh, we uh, I telling you that HIV is an infection uh, which will form human immunodeficiency syndrome virus and AIDS is the stage of HIV. You can say it is the last stage of uh, HIV infection. Because HIV infection is a viral infection and it takes so many times, 10 years to 35 years or it is a very fatal disease, life-threatening disease and the patient suffers so much. So it, it is the AIDS uh, squared immune deficiency syndrome virus is, a, is the last stage of HIV. Is AIDS infection a universally fatal diagnosis? Yes, a small percentage of uh, people with HIV infection have been observed to possess this immune system that keeps the virus at uh, by for a few years, like 10 years to 35 years and so more. So, although an HIV diagnosis was considered death sentence, and this is evidence that such long time uh, survivors or non progressive can live a normal asymptomatic life without intervention. Importantly, we can learn a great deal about prevention of disease and infection by studying these exceptional people who have survived without it and have warded off infection. So doctor, in your view, like is the body's innate immune response as important as the adaptive immune response? What is the difference between them? Uh, researchers have observed that some people who have been infected for many years do not develop disease. Others have been exposed many occasions to HIV but do not become infected in these cases. The immune system, innate immune system uh, have been exposed of many occasions to HIV but do not become infected. The innate immune system, the first line of defense against virus appears to play an important role. If the inner innate immune response fails, then adaptive immune actively reflected by T and B cells come into action. Increase attention to innate immune system and its variety of immune cells and secreted factors. By focusing on this early activity against HIV, uh, researchers have a better chance of discovering ways to prevent infections and disease. How do CD8 plus T cells combat HIV and how is it useful in the, in the treatment of HIV? As you know, the immune system is a very complex system of cells or multiple mechanisms for taking down a pathogen. Even with 30 plus years of HIV research, how immune cells behave when the virus enters the body is not fully understood. 
one immune cell of long time interest to hiv aids scientist is the cd8 plus c lymphocyte which is primarily uh, thought to control hiv infections by killing infected cells uh, these cells can imply an alternate mechanism for controlling hiv infection it can secrete factors that suppress uh, suppress the virus without killing the cell and then the infected cell can continue to function but without virus pro uh, production and cell death because this immune uh, responses handles all hiv types it would be important in approaches aimed at enhancing immune antiviral response and in the development of vaccine importantly both activities of cd8 plus c cell need to be appreciated tell us doctor when uh, this anti retroviral therapy should be given to patients yes there is no denying the success of anti uh, retroviral medicine art therapy have we have had a lowering viral loads reducing transmission and helping people live a relatively normal life with hiv often uh, doctors prescribe these drugs upon diagnosis but uh, uh, whether the long term side effects which include uh, kidney and liver disorder are worth if a patient is asymptomatic prescribing art for a lifetime is like giving chemo chemotherapy forever future studies may vary well indicate that toxicities will eventually result in many treated individuals there also exists concern regarding the recent trend of treatment as prevention in which healthcare professionals or doctors give antiretroviral drug antiretroviral drug to hiv negative people who substantially reduce their odds of infection this treatment strategy is new but it is unclear whether a lack of adherence because of drug side effects including nausea fatigue will affect the uh, recognizing the importance success of art uh, it seems misguided to just look at the short term benefit in your view what are the strategies that should be considered for an hiv vaccine yes one of the greatest uh, weakness of existing hiv vaccine uh, such a clinical uh, clinical trials have been done most reporting limited if any success is that they are mainly looking to find a better antibody to neutralize the virus on the basis of pre clinical work uh, that there are missed opportunities to invest in basic science and study over vaccine uh, strategies such as enhancing the anti viral response of immune cells particularly those of the innate immune system he also uh, also advocate further studies of individuals who have been highly exposed to hiv but are not infected and evaluation of killed virus vaccine what approaches should be encouraged for an hiv cure a cure of hiv infection which is uh, which is exam uh, exemplified in the berlin patient has stimulated approaches to achieving this goal for an infected people this person received a stem cell transplant from a donor who was genetically resistant to hiv that some of the direction chooses to affect a cure are not based on well established experimental fact and eliminating a virus that has integrated itself into the genes of a cell requires a better understanding of the challenge uh, some uh, 
doctors appreciated the pilot studies involving genetic editing that could mimic the treatment used for the berlin patient and believe that the most immediate change of success is one directed at enhancing the anti hiv response of the immune system that strategies has uh, explain could bring persistent control of hiv as seen in healthy infected long term survivor in this case viral replication and its potential detrimental effects would be avoided it is uh, essentially the infected individual would be functionally cured thank you so much dr malik for coming to medi circle and sharing your insightful views about aids thank you so much for your contribution that you have made in the awareness series thank you ma'am